Onions are a really important part of starting off any dish, I think, and I think it would be very unfortunate if you're allergic to them. Anyway, we're going to look at them today very briefly, the different varieties, and also look at how to chop one, because I think that a dicing an onion is quite an important skill to have in the kitchen. So I've just got very few here. I've just got a regular brown onion, which I'm going to be cutting up in a moment. Um, a red onion, which are really lovely for salads. They have a so softer, sweeter flavour. Um, and they do bleed their colour quite a lot, so not so good for cream sauce, say. And we're looking at shallots as well. So we've got a banana shallot here um, and just a regular shallot. And you can tell a shallot from a pickling onion because they have two, they're like a, a daffodil bulb, say, and they have two parts to the, um, to the actual whole onion. They come apart in segments. So all we're going to be doing is just chopping the onion in a fine dice today. So what you need to do for that is just cut off the top where the stalk would have been and we're going to just peel away um, any of the brown chapery skin first of all. And what you want to try and do is leave the um, root on and that's going to enable all the onion to stay together. So there we are. So you can see I've just left that root on. It doesn't matter if there's a bit of skin around there. And then cut through that root. So we're leaving the root again, still intact. And you can see from the onion has natural lines on there, natural striations already. And what you want to try and do is cut along those natural lines, leaving the root intact still. So can you see that that's actually as a, as a hinge. Then you want to just slice across, giving you a lovely fine dice from your onion there. And as you can see, it's lovely and even, and keeping that root on just holds everything together. And then you can just lay that down and finish chopping. And there's our finely chopped onion.